What is that? Oh. We left off with the dynamic duo diligently designing their next step in the radiant heat floor installation. Let's check in with Gary. What is that? Oh, this is awesome. This is a hot water tank from an RV, and we're going to use it for our uh, radiant heat floor. Gary's acquired an RV hot water heater. However, additional materials are needed. Pump, propane tank, DC thermostat, solar panel, solar controller, marine battery, and fittings that would challenge any puzzle connoisseur. We'll look at Gary's plan in a minute, but first, the guys build a small enclosure to contain the heating system. Let's look at Gary's design. This is a closed water system. The hot water tank will be placed on the top shelf to gravity feed the pump below. Propane connections will then be attached. The pump will be connected to the cold inlet of the hot water tank. The inlet of the pump will be connected to the cold side of the radiant floor tubing. The outflow from the hot water tank will plumb to the hot side of the radiant floor tubing. If the plumbing was reversed, hot water could damage the pump. For initially filling the closed system, a water valve will be installed near the bottom closest to the pump on the inlet side. To bleed air from the system, a valve will be placed near the top of the hot water tank. Now for the electrical system. A 12 volt solar controller will be used to route the various electrical components. A battery will be placed under the hot water tank. A solar panel will be installed on the roof. The controller will be wired matching the plus to plus and minus to minus. The room's thermostat, not shown, will be wired from the hot side from the pump to the controller. Here we have the hot water tank that stores our hot water. This is our um, controller. The battery is down here below on the right. And then back just a little bit to the left is our pump. And this is the propane tank, and the solar panel is up on a roof. Here's the DC thermostat. It has the, uh, the actual temperature, room temperature here, and then the adjuster pops in. No! Dad, I don't know if you've noticed, but it's 90 degrees outside. <laughs> yeah, but I bought five gallons of propane. We need to use it up!